I was the biggest thief in the neighborhood. I stole from everybody, Doc. <laughs> Hello, folks, and welcome to another edition of The Legacy. I'm your host, Doc Walker. Each week, we try to include some old school, new school with one thing in mind, and that is to win. And we are thrilled to bring another winner to the program. That's old number 25, Joe Washington. Go, go. How you doing, man? Doc, I'm doing fine. As long as you're in the house, I'm okay. You in big games. There was nobody, man. I mean, we had a big play type of team with you, JR, Arthur, CB, all them guys. But for you, it's almost every moment you seized it, whether it's Oklahoma, Texas, the bigger the, 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 the format, whether it's Monday night football, you with the Colts, I'll never forget it. All of us can still see you with that return against the Colts. You've thrown them, you've caught them, you've done everything. So what was it like for you not to have your biggest moment in the Super Bowl? Um, for me, not to be able to really just contribute. And control it, because you controlled that was, it. That was, uh, that, that was tough. And, and you know what, the only, the only way I was able to come to grips with that is because, you know, knowing that you weren't fully healthy. Right. And, you know, uh, you, you know, you had a disadvantage. And, you know, I, I, that was the only way I could come to grips with that. Only way. But then again, like I say, I knew and I always felt, I say, hey, you give me two healthy legs and I tell you what, I can move mountains. <laughs> I'm probably the most optimistic guy on the planet, but I am a realist. You know, those two, for the most part, most people think that, you know, you can't be both. I am. I am. You can't just be one and you know and not be able to uh, uh survive in the world with that just that one attitude you've, you've got to have you know the, the viewpoint to where you can see both the ends of the trees and you know i think you know i do that you know uh, pretty well so that in itself helped me because of that drive for me to be the person in those particular you know situations because i always want I don't care, you know, I don't care if we're 100 points behind if we got time on it, I think I can do something. Joe Washington, folks, AKA Liberace, okay? <laughs> There's never been a man that was better dressed, had his own wardrobe closet for his uniform. He wore three per game. He had a pregame warm-up uniform, then he put on the game uniform, and he changed at halftime. And if it was wet, he had an additional deal. And the only time I ever saw him angry, we played a Monday night game against the San Diego Chargers. And Jay Bernetti, our beloved equipment guy who's with the Niners as we currently tape this, he forgot his belt. Oh my goodness. Joe Washington, Art Monk went nuts over his sanitaries he wore. See, you when you own the legacy, you get to find out insider information. <laughs> you in this uniform in this silver shoes. You wrote your book, The Silver Shoes. Now you take it away and tell us what turned you into this. You know what? I just truly believe that to play good, you gotta look good, and of course, you gotta feel good. Your stuff has to fit you. And I, and you know what? Another thing, you know, you always wanted to be unique. And, and that's one thing I think most, you know, players feel, but a lot of them won't admit. I mean, hey, I, I don't want to be like everybody else. I want to be me. And you know what? I was the biggest thief in the neighborhood. I stole from everybody, Doc. If this kid here could run a certain way, to, hey, I got it. I watched Gail Sayers, Jim Brown. I watched everybody. Hey, I watched you. You know what? I watched you when you came in on the bang. I said, mm -mm, I want to do something like that. Hey, I'm, hey, I was the biggest thief. Hey, I want to be able to take all of it, roll it into one, and make sure that I am the most unique person on the planet. And hey, and I am efficient in any and everything I want to do. And 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 that's just how it, you know, it, it came about. I just, I just always felt like that, and I was motivated to try and be as good as I could ever be, 
And I always wanted to be able to do something that nobody else would even think about doing. This portion of The Legacy is presented by your local Nissan dealer. At Honda, we take the holidays seriously. With serious style and serious capability. So while others may be decking the halls, you could be dashing through the snow with the best value of the season. Now's the best time to get into a new Honda. KBB.com's best value brand for 2020. Visit Happy Honda Days at your local Honda dealer or shop online to get a great offer on the CRV. Free healthcare, hundreds to more than $1,000 per month in disability compensation and tens of thousands for college tuition. These are just some of the U.S. Department of Veterans Affairs benefits that may be available to veterans. VA is focused on customer service like never before. Choose VA and see why veterans' trust in VA reached an all-time high. Claim the benefits you've earned at choose.va.gov. <laughs> Yeah, things are a little different this year. Happy holidays! And we wish you a But it's good to know you can count on holiday scratch-offs from the Maryland Lottery. Multiply the cheer. Please play safely and responsibly. The best team has a great sense of family. The best family has a great culture. And within that culture, there is great character. When you have all those elements come together, you've got a team. D.C. has a home for the greatest hits of all time. That would be Michael Jackson for me. D.C.'s greatest hits. Madonna. Billy Idol. Live here. Cindy Lauper. Bon Jovi. 94.7. Blondie. The Eagles. The Drive. After three quarters of this toe-to-toe -to -toe slugfest, the punch-drunk Lions seem ready to fall. And running back Joe Washington delivered what appeared to be the final crushing blow. A wing to the far side, Walker in motion now to the near side. On first down, Joe Washington to carry. Got blockers inside the 10, the 5, still on his feet to the 2, leans to the 1, did he make it? Touchdown, Joe Washington! Oh, oh my goodness, what a run! Holy moly! That little devil pushed three people into the end zone. He is a little devil, isn't he? <laughs> he, is, he is beautiful. What was your thing? about Detroit. What do you tell me about that? Hey, all I know is this. Hey, everybody, you know, compares all of our backs. But I always want to make sure that they know that maybe the latest, but I'm going to be the greatest. <laughs> so that is it right there. <laughs> I've not seen you worked up. There's something about them Detroit Lions. I kept thinking, I said, well, there have been a lot of great backs, and especially Sooners. And they've come out of it, but what was it about you got your dandruff up against the Lions? That's it? <laughs> hey, hey, that's it. When you're playing a former teammate or someone has come along on the same road, you want to make sure that they know that you were there before they were there. You just do it. Hey, you just automate. Hey, that's just, I'm telling you, yeah, that's just me. That's just me from a kid. Hey, this is your neighborhood, you know, and you want to be recognized in your neighborhood. Yeah, That's well, all there is to it. Ain't nothing personal. I understand. Yeah, you it seems like it, it though. You just wanna, you just wanna let let it be known and let it be seen that you ain't chopped liver. You know what I mean? Of all your highlights, when you wore the burgundy and gold, what was your favorite game? Uh, Detroit. <laughs> <laughs> your era. You had the roughest edge rushers in the world. Yes, How we did. in the heck did you survive that? <laughs> You know what? <laughs> I always, you know, hey, to be honest with you, as a kid, I always wanted to be a center or a lineman. <laughs> you know why? Wait till the so, Boston kids that. Yeah, because number one, they're the first. 
you know, back in the day, you know how the guys used to come out of the hole, you know, used to, they used to come out kind of cool and roll. And oh, yeah, and yeah. Like well, yeah. the center was the first one to do that. Yeah, he ran out. Yeah, yeah. I love that. you know yeah, what? I love and I wanted to be that guy to do that and then take control because nothing happens until the center happens. Oh, no, you know what I mean? no, no, you're right. All you're right. right. Hey, so then I realized that I wasn't going to be big enough to do that. And I just love the physical aspect of the game. And I knew I wasn't going to be a, a eventually wasn't going to be a physical runner like that to run over people. Mm -hmm. So I just started watching guys, how they block. And I said, oh man, if I could just do that. So again, here we go again. If it was just a chance for me to take something from somebody else, you know, be that thief again and make it my own and be able to take pride in being able to hit guys. And, and, and you know what? And the greatest thing, hey, even better than anything else, Doc, when we had a pass play and it calls for the back to pass block, they didn't have to substitute my little ass. That's you right. hear me? That's right. And hey, I, hey, that was my greatest feather in the cap for me to be able to stand in there and joke and all my other quarterbacks have the confidence knowing that, hey, it ain't going to be my man. Hey, it ain't going to be my man. And, and I just, you know, just took pride in it. It was fun for me. Those guys, you guys took, took care of me. And I mean, you guys were some of the most physical people I had ever seen. I mean, look, let me tell you something. Today, all I know is this. <laughs> you guys would be in jail with the way you all used to put block on folks. <laughs> you, you wouldn't finish the game. No. And you banging it off. Hey, can you imagine some of these guys banging on some of these uh, linemen the way you used to come in motion like that? Hey, I see. It, it. ain't a one that can do it. It's 2020. Let's make a splash. Play the DC Lottery's Roaring Cash. The best team has a great sense of family. The best family has a great culture. And within that culture, there is great character. When you have all those elements come together, you've got a team. Oh, we love our new home. Neighborhood's great. Amazing school district. The HOA has been very involved. These shrubs aren't board approved. You need to break down your cardboard. Thank you. Violation. Violation. I see you've met Cynthia. At least GEICO makes bundling our home and car insurance easy. And does help us save a bunch of money. Two inches over regulation! Thanks, Cynthia. For bundling made easy, go to geico.com. DC has a home for the greatest hits of all time. That would be Michael Jackson for me. DC's greatest hits. Madonna. Billy Idol. Live here. Cindy Lauper. Bon Jovi. 94-7. Blondie. The Eagles. The Drive. It's all-wheel drive season, and your local Honda dealers are bringing the best deals of the year. It's clearance pricing during the Happy Honda Days sales event. Dash through the snow to a rugged and adventurous Honda. Check out the entire all-wheel drive truck and SUV lineup. CRV, HRV, Ridgeline, Pilot, and Passport. With features like Honda Sensing, Magic Folding Seats, and three different driving modes. Clearance pricing is here, but it won't last long. Don't miss clearance pricing at the Happy Honda Day sales event. Now at your local Honda dealer. The Legacy is brought to you by Janet King. Let Janet King get your business back to business. Visit to schedule a disinfecting service today. I see something in this group that I think is unlimited. I think they can control their destiny. Now they gotta all be on the same page because yeah, they well, can't make mistakes. They can't help people beat them. Right now, the Giants and the football team might be positioning themselves better than almost anybody in the NFC. And I never saw that nine weeks ago. What do you see? Well, hey, I see the same thing. You know, they're, they're, they're coming to the 
to the uh, promised land at the right time. It seems as if, you know, everybody is uh, under, it seems as if everybody's on the same page. Right. You got to work hard in practice. You got to, hey, practice has to get go up another level. Yeah. Because, hey, you don't just go in the game. You Hey, you have got to do everything in practice with intensity. And I Inside too, drill, you ain't hey, lying. Absolutely. Short yardage, goal, everything. Oh. Oh, oh, the whole thing. I mean, you got to run everything sharp. You got to run everything as if you're going in a game. You got to, you know, get in uh, 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 Jake and, and, and Grimm's hip pockets and let them know oh, that yeah. you're right there. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. Hey, and make sure, you know, and you know what? When you're walking back to the and say, that's the way to go, Big Jake. Yeah. You know what? These Means guys a lot. like that, man. Yeah. Means hey, a lot. And you know what? And you should, because you know what? If it wasn't for them, hey, you'd be hanging up there on a tree, some dog. Yeah, hey, yeah, so lie. I want I want you, hey, and I'm gonna tell you again now, I want you to know that I appreciated the bodyguards I had. Yeah, sure. you had personal protectors. <laughs> I figured like we were like CIA. My brother, it was an honor to work for you and a pleasure to have you join us here on the legacy. Give the girls a hug for me. And, um, you know, we'll do it again in 2021. You know we will. All right, Doc. Take care, man. I sure appreciate it. Hail to the football team. Joe Washington, folks, as Coach Thompson would say, he's simply one of the best. That'll do it for this week's edition of The Legacy. Join us each and every week as we try to take you inside the minds of some guys at Water Burgundy and Gold, true champions. We'll see you next week.